Hey, hey, Fash. It is the 23rd of January, 2019. Probably won't upload this till tomorrow. It's kind of late. But I've been sitting on this article here since yesterday morning. Uh, and when I first saw it, uh, a million things just came rushing through. And quite frankly, it, it just gets better every time. Let's put it that way. I mean, God is just awesome so i see this and i i couldn't really get to doing a video or studied very much on it and, until i'm getting to it now but i did you know contact a couple brethren and threw it out at them and there's so much to this one simple uh seemingly simple thing here that it's just amazing you know football you know it's a very idolized thing uh it has managed to turn a lot of people into like spaghetti brains uh following their teams and their fantasy football and everything right well just this is crazy okay you got the los angeles rams we'll get into that and their record for the year was 15 and 3 i see the 153 and i don't know what i just did right there but I see the 153, and then I hop over here, and the Saints, their record for the year was 14-4. and four. So I got, right off the bat, 153 and a 144, which I just found to be quite interesting. And it turns out that the game went into overtime, okay, which is known as sudden death, right? And it was tied at 23-23. to 23. Now, this is crazy. Don't forget, this is football. The Vesica Pisces, the 23 and the 23, right? So you got the Saints. I don't know what the heck that is. This, these things drive me nuts. Um, the 23, 23. And so this is crazy, guys. The Saints, uh, th this logo right here is actually a lily. That's, it's a stylized lily. And you look up lilies in the Bible, okay? It's, it's fascinating. Uh, but it's also used in the occult world to represent all kinds of things. But it's a lily, right? And the Saints are the team that lost with their 23 points. So that 23, it's gone. It's finished. It's over. It's out of here, right? Just like 153, all the fish in the net. And that's kind of strange how those are opposite. Because this is representing basically the Jews, the ones who haven't accepted Christ. Even if they're non-Jews, just all that haven't accepted him, who aren't watching him and, and awaiting him. And the ram is a sacrificial animal. That's what it's used for, almost exclusively, really. Um, it, it's a sacrifice. And, and the ram's horn, you see how it's so prevalent in this logo, a big six it looks like. But the ram's horn was what instrument was used to take down the walls of Jericho. The walls, because that's what we're still dealing with here. The wall, the wall that Jesus broke down, but is still fully erected to the rest of the world who don't know Jesus. I hope that makes sense, right? And so they go into sudden death overtime. And there's all kinds of things we could get into about this. There really is. Even right down to this play taking place on at 1404, second and 16, the six times six times six, 216, the 144 again, right? So anyway, the Rams end up winning because of this, this play that shouldn't have happened apparently, right? And they win 26 to 23 over the Saints, right? Now, this, this right here is just off the hook crazy when I show you this. 26 23 in the hebrew now because because this is basically referring to those who still think that you know they're going to the super bowl they're going to achieve their glory in in the flesh they're going to do their sacrifices to to for remission of sin you see what i mean it's all about the flesh and it just ain't gonna fly but <laughs> 26 23 you guys just think about this it is literally kind that is a saint a holy one merciful saint I, I can you actually believe that 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 is 2623 i can't 
and it's Super Bowl 53. The Jews, Isaiah 53, they just will not accept that their Messiah was prophesied and came and they killed him. But that's what's happening. This is the separation. The wall's been broken, but the walls are being built in the flesh. Do you know Jesus? Because if you don't, you're going to be behind that wall, stuck in that hatred. you, you got to understand this stuff. You need Jesus Christ. End of discussion. That is the bottom line. You know? So, and again, it goes much further than this. But i got to cut this one short. Uh, let's not forget the 26th uh, is also the Tetragrammaton, the name of God. Okay, think about this stuff. That's insane to me. It just truly is. But there it is. It's it, What can I tell you? And, and it does. It truly does goes on. I, I hope I'm led to continue with this because this is absolutely fascinating. A saint, 2623, the th unreal. Anyway, I hope this blesses someone. Seek Jesus and peace and grace to all of you. Many fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore take unto you the whole armor of God, 